A new recovery center focused on tackling the opioid crisis holds a grand opening in Mount Hope. Newswatch reporter Jacob Comer was there to get the details. Friday marked the grand opening of a new Veltex recovery group location in Mount Hope. The new facility is focused on recovery services for those struggling with addiction. According to the site's medical director, the new center is just one step the state is taking to tackle the drug crisis. We plan to do a comprehensive recovery program for people that have addiction as a disease. The grand opening welcomed various speakers, including representatives from Senator Manchin and Senator Capito's office, as well as Representative Carol Miller. The CFO for Veltex even came all the way from Chicago to be a part of the grand opening and speak on the company's effort to combat the opioid crisis. We looked at West Virginia and looked at this property and said this is an ideal location for us to uh, set up a center. It's not just in West Virginia, but across the entire country. It's, it's a serious matter. As well, the event welcomed State Delegate Jordan Maynard, who is the newest delegate for the Raleigh, Summers, and Monroe County area. Maynard grew up in Mount Hope and saw the center as a sign of good progress for the community. West Virginia, as we know, has dealt with the drug epidemic for years now, and we need to do everything we can uh, to help those in need and to get people back on their feet, and Veltex is here to be a part of the solution. The new center is already working on getting roughly 100 residents in the facility and the outpatient program is expected to start in the next few weeks. Reporting in Mount Hope, Jacob Comer, Newswatch. The Veltex Recovery Group chose Mount Hope for its new facility because it was their ideal location to begin tackling the opioid crisis here in southern West Virginia.